Hi everybody, Mike Hoffman here, and today we're going to look at how we can use GPS track log data to automatically add location data to our images within the map module of Lightroom 5. Notice the collections panel here at the left. I have a collection of photos I took with a DSLR, and they do not have image GPS data, as we can see, because there's no map icon on the image thumbnails. However, while I was taking these images, I was running a GPS logger on my smartphone. I was using the app called Geotag Photos Pro, but there are other similar apps out there. Many dedicated GPS devices will also allow you to create track logs. Just check the user manual. It's very important that when you use this process, the date and time on your camera and your GPS device or your smartphone, if you're using that, must be completely in sync. So check that before you go out and shoot. The GPS logger creates a track log file with the extension .gpx, and we can load that by going to the map module. Here we'll select this little icon at the bottom, and we'll choose load track log. We'll select this track log, crescentlake.gpx. And when we click Open, the map changes to the location where this track log was generated, and we can see the route that was recorded. And in this case, it was a walk around this particular lake. Hovering the cursor over the track displays the exact time for each point along the track. That's pretty amazing by itself, but it gets better. Down here in the film strip, we'll click the first image and then We'll press Control A or Command A on a Mac to select all the images. Now we'll return to this little icon with the pop-up menu and we'll choose Auto Tag 56 Selected Photos. It takes a few seconds and then just like that our photos are placed on the map at exactly the right locations along the route recorded by the smartphone. Once the images are on the map, we have the same icons that we saw in a previous video when we placed them manually. We can see the thumbnails if we hover over these icons, and we can click to move through the images as we saw before. We can deselect the images in the film strip by pressing Ctrl D or Command D on a Mac, and then clicking any one shows here in the metadata panel that the image has GPS data. This GPS data has been extracted from the matching data within the GPX track log file. We've mapped our images using a track log and provided ourselves with yet another way of categorizing, organizing, searching, and viewing the photos within our image catalog.